One recent feature addition to 3D Coat as a build 4.9.41 is Catmull Clark subdivision in the Retopo workspace. Let me show how that works. I'm going to isolate this visor object here by holding down the Alt key and clicking the visibility icon. And I'll do the same thing in the Sculpt Tree. It applies to both a selected group of polygons or the entire mesh on the layer. So should I select a group of faces here, I can scroll down to the selected section and I'll see subdivide as well as smooth selected. Subdivide has always been here in 3D Coat. It's flat subdivision. It will not smooth. However, this new addition, Smooth Selection introduces Catmull Clark subdivision. So it will not only subdivide, but it will also smooth. Now, if I click Subdivide, you can see again, it's just flat subdivision. I'll go ahead and hit Escape. And I will select this group as well, and then choose Smooth Selection. Now, there doesn't seem to be a lot of difference between the two, but as I'll show here momentarily, there is quite a difference. Let's undo a few times. Now I will apply it to the entire object. So instead of going to the selected section, I can scroll down to the entire mesh section and I see the same options. I'll go ahead and subdivide this one. Now I'll hide that layer and go to a copy of it. This time I'll click Smooth CC. One thing you'll notice is the UV seams have moved off those hard edges, like you see here. And that just indicates it's been smoothed. Now, let's take a look at how it appears without the UV seams and without the wireframe. Let's turn off the wireframe and hide the UV seams as well as the colored UV islands. And I'll also turn off the checker. There is a bit of fastening, but we have not smoothed enough to get rid of a lot of that fastening. Now let's hide that and go to the other version and you can see how much of a difference there is. Also, we can look at a smooth view. At the time of this recording, it's a beta feature, but in future versions of 3D Coat, it will be a default feature. To access it, you may need to go to the Edit menu under Preferences in the Beta section and make sure to check Show Beta Tools. When you do that, you will see that as an option. And that's a quick look at the Catmull Clark subdivision in 3D Coats of Retopo Workspace. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.